get Danielle four margaritas after we get out. Don't be over here making me put it in my. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to our channel. I'm AJ. This is Danny. We're hashtag. 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 Hashtag the cannons. B C T V. Welcome back to our eating show. show. Today we're back with another move on. And y'all see it. I'm gonna go, y'all know y'all see it. I'm gonna go ahead and let Danielle tell you what it is for the sake of it. Y'all, today we have a seafood boil that is drenched in some good old butter sauce. So let me see if I can remember everything that's in here. Uh -huh. We got boiled eggs, oh, of sausage, yeah. crab legs, yeah. prawns, yeah. corn, potatoes, scallops, and lobster tail. Yeah. Did I get that? Oh, go ahead, girl. Look at you rolling <laughs> off the list. All right, y'all. If this is your very first time on your channel, thank you for being here. If you're good, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell as well. Make sure you set it to all such a notification to all. So you'll be notified every single time that we upload, guys. Every time that we drop some heat. What are that? Oh, yeah. And remember, remember to hit that like button. Very important. Guys, remember hashtag grow, baby. Grow hashtag the candidates are on the road to 100K, y'all. So thank y'all for being here. We're going to go ahead and pray so we can get in this food. Father God, in the name of Jesus, we ask you to bless this food. Let it be nourished our bodies and thank you for it. I'm so blessed, also less fortunate. All these things we ask in Son Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. <coughs> Jesus Christ. All right, y'all. Get this fresh capote up. Y'all already know the deal. We got gloves on the bank. We do. Get in that mug. Myself, not to eat hard. Don't eat hard. Yes, even though we have one gloves, we still very much share. So if you see me lick my fingers, her lick her fingers, <laughs> or something like that, even though we have lick one gloves, my just know that it's a, uh, it's just a nice, oh, I'm gonna get, look at this, yeah. little sachet, mm -hmm. little sachet for mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get messy on you. Mm -hmm. so, I'm gonna move some of these crab legs out. Make it easier. You wanna put a couple cups on your side? Mm -hmm. Just to make it easier for us to get in here. Thank you. Yeah! Mm -hmm. This is the bowl, y'all. Can't really do too much still, but. With a little scallop! Nothing about it. Good. Season food. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Look at that garlic. Okay. Look at this potato. Look at that flavor. It's cool. So good and tasty. Mm. Sauces outstanding. Mm -hmm. 
Speaking of outstanding, I gotta go watch Charlie. Hmm? First name Charlie. <laughs> Last name Whipson. <clears throat> Did his little tiny bit. I don't know. The problem's on that side. <laughs> gotta get in there. There you go. Mm. Mm. I'm sorry, y'all. <laughs> this made me happy. <laughs> the crab button would tear me up. It'll tear you up soon as the uh, part stop, boy. <laughs> This man, this is delicious. Um, might have to get Danielle four margaritas after we get out. Don't be over here making me put it in my pussy. You <laughs> <laughs> get the part that you get. Bow is the everything. Oh, besides the uh, last. Wait up. We don't go to five. Wait a damn minute. <laughs> wait a damn. <laughs> we don't go to five around here. Wait a minute. We don't go to five. <clears throat> I was ready to eat this, but I didn't think it was going to be... This is good. No, I'm over here forgetting about my crab. That's just something. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. <clears throat> Traditionally, y'all, uh, I don't usually boil crab legs. I like mm -hmm. the steamed crab legs. Because I like the, the flavor of the meat on its own. But... I threw them in the pot today. Mm -hmm. And, uh. That's me trying to. <clears throat> Start it up. <clears throat> trying to keep them. Get in there and get in there. See what this little crab leg talking about. Mm -hmm. Man, it's spicy. <laughs> <coughs> I get to what we talking today. Mm. <laughs> Cause it's not looking good. <laughs> Y'all, if you just pause the video, go get you some seafood and mm -hmm. come back. Come back and eat with us.
crab leg meat just slipping out. Mm -hmm. I don't like to fight. No. People who boil their crab, like if you don't boil any seafood, like I used to don't. I said I boil my crab legs even though I boil like shrimp and other stuff. I boil blue crabs, but I ain't about to boil no um, snow because I like the flavor. Mm -hmm. I mean, I use it. But if you're going to do it, you got to season your pot. For people who just boil them, just, I don't know. One lady a long time ago, she was thinking she was giving me advice, I, even though I didn't ask for it. I ain't trying to be shady, I'm just saying. Because my crab legs that we got were already overcooked. Because they, you know, snow crab come cooked. And so they overcooked them before they froze them. Because the whole batch was like that. No matter what, you just heat them up. That was like, you break the shell, the meat was breaking before you could, like you can barely pull on it, it was already mush. Mm -hmm. Or just close to it. So she was telling me uh, her method because she thought that I had just, I was just couldn't get out the shell. Mm -hmm. Right, baby. It involved no seasoning and a lot of water. Hell no! Mm -hmm. I was like, <laughs> even if I ask you for this advice, there ain't no way. Mm -mm. Boiling this in straight water can't do it. Steam them, but I ain't about to boil them. Boil the, uh, like in just plain water. Mm. I don't see that. Mm. Yeah, I don't think we talked about this the other day, but we was in Walmart and I got this thing about uh, old folk. <laughs> Old black men working in Walmart. She do, is I do. I thought about it but after. In all, uh, <laughs> in all, what's the word I'm looking for? In her defense, yes. <laughs> the ones that they be, they be doing what she be saying. Like, mm -hmm. She be having a reason to put it that way. Right. <laughs> so, this particular gentleman. Because I ain't going to talk about the other one that be at the other Walmart that get on my nerves. Anyway, he's riding the thing that y'all know like cleans the floor. Like it's this big machine. Normally I see it with nobody on it. But anyway, he was on it. And I, AJ and I just felt like he kept trying to get in people's way. He was. like, And he confirmed it that last time. Yeah, it was, that was it for me. I know he was. And it wasn't even the point of him riding the thing and cleaning the floor. It's the simple fact that he goes through the self-checkout and then holds the horn button on the thing. And then, Sir, do your mouth work? The thing ain't that loud. He get right up. Oh. The lady that was patrolling self-checkout, the worker, she was right there. Mm -hmm. And she was just, you know, doing her job, looking at her uh, palm pilot, looking at self-checkout, making sure everything was going right. Mm. And he's beside her. Now, granted, you this when he's in the area, you pretty much hear just the machine. You hear it whirring. It's kind of mm -hmm. loud, but not loud enough to where you got to shout. So he had been like driving around her for a little bit anyway. Mm -hmm. And I guess he wanted her to move. So then he lays on the horn, which is not really like a burn. It's like, a, like it's a loud, like high pitched noise. Right. And you almost won't hear it at first. Mm -hmm. After a couple of seconds, you be like, Dude, what is that? And that's what she did. I guess she was standing there for a second. Then she realized that she looked up and then she's like, oh, she stepped back. Oh, like, she a good one because he could have just said, excuse me, but right. that he was intentionally trying to be in people's way. And mm -hmm. so then, because when he first came through there, he drove through us and we were in line. And so right. we got closer to the self-checkout. He goes, or he had gone around the self-checkout, you know, they build out like in like boxes. And he was on the other side where he encountered the worker and he goes through the self-checkout. Now, this is busy at this point in time. Mm -hmm. All the registers are taking up. People standing there with their carts and their kids and everything. Mm -hmm. And he determined to go through there. Now, granted, this self-checkout area, my, the line we standing in is, and all that is busy. But all the floor <laughs> behind the self-checkout register, like close to the ice and all that, going all the way up the aisle, all the other registers are clear and open. Even mm -hmm. the two beside the self-checkouts that we're at, like on the other side of the wall. No, he come through there, then he goes out, goes back through there, and then he goes as if he's going, um, as if he's going through the other aisles. I thought he was going to leave. Nope. He come right back through the self-checkout. 
Get your ass out of here. This time, I couldn't believe what I was seeing because it was a post there, and this girl <clears throat> was, uh, she was checking out or she was waiting on something. She's standing there with her cart. He just gonna sit there in front of her, like with her baby, and she was like, "I ain't moving." Like she's <laughs> like, she didn't say that, but she did. She, I'm pretty sure she That's saw. What she looked like she was looking like, "I ain't moving." He just mm-hmm. gonna sit there, like, "Why are you coming? Why are you trying to force your way around this right. pole anyway?" Like it's super busy at this moment right there. Like I'm pretty sure if he needed to clean that stuff, check out floors, they would have been there. First of all, mm-hmm. let me tell you this: I don't work at Walmart before. Ain't nothing that urgent when it comes down to cleaning because they do more cleaning at night than they do in the daytime anyway. Mm. I said he on there wasting time for one, but then mm-hmm. he intentionally getting the people away. The lady that he worked with, his coworker, should have cussed him out. You damn right. All right, he was, if, old girl that was standing there with her, with her child, with her baby. Like if I was her, I would have got his ass. I'm like, what are you doing, right. bro? Like, why are you intentionally trying to be in people's way? Like. It and was, it's almost like when he was coming through, because even when he came by us with the pole, it's like he demands you to move without <laughs> saying something. And I'm like, sir, you ain't got to come this way. Very intentional. Mm-hmm. But please run my toe over so I can get some money. Oh my god. I ain't seen so I ain't never seen somebody go out of the way and be an asshole like that. Right. He worse than the other man. That I talk about at the other Walmart. They yeah, don't like the other dude because. Y'all, he don't speak. He don't speak. He don't say nothing. He'll just sit there and stare at you. And I have this thing, especially people that look like me. If we make eye contact, and we are in the South. Um, hey, how you doing? Hello, something. No, this man will just look at you like, why are you in this Walmart and I don't want to work? <laughs> and I'm like, sir, do you just smile a little bit? He, he a jackass too. Hmm? He a jackass too. Mm-hmm. Don't smile at all. Don't say nothing. If that particular day he is supposed to be... um. Checking for receipts, he would just stand there and look at you like present it, mm-hmm. your presentation. I always walk right past him because <laughs> he don't know open his mouth and say nothing. So, Mm-mm. you know, I got an item outside the bag, I ain't stopping. Mm-hmm. He can't say nothing no other time. It ain't like I need you to speak, but he be staring like he got an attitude problem, but he mm-hmm. wants. I'm just like, at least if you ain't gonna speak, smile. I'm like, you yeah. know. Like, man, what's wrong with you? Mm. Damn, I can't stand <laughs> He don't bother me because I'm like, fuck him. But <laughs> My God, I don't even know his name, but he get on my nerves. I'll be like, AJ, look at him. Look at him over there. <laughs> <laughs> So I had no clue that this month was Black Music Month. I don't know if you knew that. But today. I can't keep up with that. No, honey. And I feel like these national whatever they be making up. <laughs> That's another subject. So they have a Black Music Challenge. And we fit in to do it. It goes by days, but honey. Mm-mm. I'm going to just leave some off. <laughs> so. Think of a song that when you hear it, it gives you the strong urge to clean the house. Um, <laughs> it be, it's, I know it's gospel songs, but it's also for me, if I hear Kelly Price, because mm-hmm. <laughs> my mom used to Your clean mom. up the R&B music, and that was it. Kelly, Kelly Price and Mary J. Blige and stuff like that. Is, and so, like, <laughs> I, I actually do think of like, Cleaning and this radio that she used to have. It was this big old, uh, what's the name of it? <clears throat> like Boomba. Oh, it wasn't really Boomba. It was in separate pieces. It was just a big six CD changer, eight CD changer. It was silver. <laughs> and the, um, they had green little uh, mirror buttons on there mm-hmm. that was like reflective and it had like auto. Y'all remember them <clears throat> old radios that used to have, it would like do the bars and then it would like run the words across that little uh, uh, that little LCD screen. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah, so I think about that radio, and I think about um, cleaning whenever I hear like mm-hmm. Jelly Price music. Or something. Mm-hmm. For me, which I've told you this, it is the Yellow Strength album from John B. <laughs> my mom put that on a Saturday morning, I want to cry. <laughs> Joe ain't something. Mm-hmm. Even now when I cleaned up, I listen to R&B music. It's mostly what I be listening to get me in the cleaning spirit. A song that immediately eases your mind or mood. Mm. Let's see. Yeah, I think on one. Mm. Uh, can't eat. Mm-mm. Eat my mom. Trying to eat. <laughs> or move. Probably. Uh. Stay with you by John Legend. Oh, um, that that always used to be a song I used to really like listen to. Mm-hmm. It's got a nice peaceful uh, melody, and I really like it. Mhm. Mm-hmm. Let me see. What do I have? <laughs> hmm. I like a lot of R and B music, and of course, gospel music changes my me my mood. But I don't know. Since you introduced me to Anthony Hamilton, because I did not listen to him before, mm-hmm. it's probably it is something about him. I just can't think right now. I like hearing cool too. Mm. If y'all cool, I like it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Let's see. She's trying to get out crab meat. <laughs> mm, crab is clutchy. Mm-hmm. Mm hmm. Time for another coin. Mm-mm. <laughs> My time for another coin. <clears throat> Let's see. A remix you preferred over the original song. Mm. I hope I'm not making this up when I say this. Um, I like Bust It Baby, but I feel like there is two parts to that song. Is there? Maybe Maybe you're thinking of uh, Shabby. Oh, Oh. maybe it is that one. I definitely think I like the remix better. I think this is, I I know I have a lot of songs I like the remix of, but one hands down, which a lot of people probably don't know about, or probably don't ever. If you, uh, Justin Timberlake's TKO, Oh. The remix has got J. Cole, J. Cole on it. Mm-hmm. I go hard. Mm-hmm. Huh. I go hard. J. Cole come on right away. Mm. Verse hard. I also be talking about I need a girl, but currently at this moment, this crab got my mind messed uh-huh. up. So I'm trying to remember, is it the part one or the part two? I like them. You said, uh, you said it's the banana, na 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 the slow mm, one the with usher. usher, yes. <laughs> the other one, whichever is, one that one is, is the one I like better. That one, genuine. Mm. That ain't what I need. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. 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 Y'all, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. get some hungry things. Mm-hmm. Well, usually, I feel like I'll be full by this point, but. Mm-hmm. These scallops are good too. Eat them like candy. Mm-mm. <clears throat> did I just eat a piece of corn? Mm-hmm. I think I did. My brain. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> must have been good. <clears throat> These prawns is busting. Mm-hmm. Everything good. Um. <clears throat> This song might be the most played song in your music library. 
<sighs> what? This song might be your most played song in your music library. Oh, for yours? I know yours. Don't you even say nothing about me. What happened to that scam family looking at? Let's eat this potato instead. That's one right there. Huh? <clears throat> oh. I felt like that was more on my side, so I threw you. I kept oh. throwing it. <laughs> Mine is Jasmine Sullivan. Hate that I need you. It's not. Or whatever it is. <laughs> now you done made me forget what I'm about to say. <laughs> How could I not know the name of it? <clears throat> Hurt me so good. Yes. <laughs> and I don't know why. But when Spotify gave me my review for the year, I think I played that song a thousand and one hundred times. <laughs> That's crazy. Mm-hmm. Which I know. Every time I would get to work. Also, when it first came out, I just ran that bit back. Just the, the reverse bird. One more time. Just one more time. We're down a dirty today. Hmm? We're down a dirty today. Mm-mm. I don't know. Usually... That's crazy, because sometimes I'll be wondering, I'll be so full on seafood bowls, mm -hmm. and I'll be wondering why, because they don't seem to be like super filling, but today, I'm going to eat them. Mm. Mm. Alright, I believe I'm tuckered out. I'm about to be, because mm. I don't want to be full. Mm-mm. Not like that. This butter sauce will relieve me soon anyway. Uh-uh. Be the worst thing because it hits you out the blue. Mm-hmm. Like, please, sir. Please, ma'am. <laughs> Did you say your most played song? Um. Probably something to do, I played that album like crazy. Mm. What, Anthems and Glory? Yes. Mm. Ooh, Woo Woo is right, honey. He just lost the town. It was good. What? They lost the town, I don't even play with them like that. I don't know, it's got a lot of good flavor. Mm hmm. The red ones, I'm telling you. Them, them, them. What of them? Them yellow ones. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> You be talking about them anyway. Maybe I'm a little fault too. I'm not a fault. Mm -hmm. That's what I feel like. Maybe it's mm -hmm. me. <sighs> this gonna put me out. What? I take out the gloves. I'm gonna go back in. Right. All right, y'all. Thank y'all for joining us today. Yes. <laughs> Really do appreciate it. If you haven't already, please make sure you sub this channel, y'all. Like this video, drop a comment down below. Let us know what you think, guys. Remember to share this video. Share it out because sharing is caring. So care about us. Care about us, y'all. We love you. We mean it. We're going to catch you on the next video. Shout out to the group. Shout out to you. Y'all have a good weekend. Have a good weekend. Bye. Peace, peace. Uh-uh.